A gardener has the task of digging an area of 800 meters square. On the first day, he digs an area of 10 meters square. So this is the first day. On each successive day, he digs an area of 1.2 times the areas that he dug the previous day. So the second day, 10 times 1.2, he's going to dig 12 meters square and so on until the day when the task is completed. Remember, he have to dig a total area of 800 meters square. Find the numbers of days needed to complete the task. So if you analyze it carefully, you have A, the first term equal to 10, and this is a geometric progression, R equal to 1.2. Now you have to make sure your Sn, Sn equal to 10 plus 12 plus the next term plus until the n term must be more than 800 because the gardener has to dig an area of 800 meter square. So you need to apply Sn formula, Sn equal to ARN minus 1 over R minus 1. So listen carefully here, make sure you don't make any calculation mistake. So what is your A, which is 10 RN minus 1, so 1.2 power N minus 1 divided by R minus 1 more than 800. So first, 1.2 minus 1 is 0 0.2. You have 10, 1.2 power n minus 1 more than 800 multiply with 0 0.2, you have 160. So remember here, you cannot multiply 10 with 1.2 power n. A lot of students are going to make mistake like that. That is 10 multiplied by 1.2 power n. This is not equal to 10 multiplied with 1.2, which is 12 power n. This is wrong. So what you should do here is 1.2 power n minus 1 more than 160 divided by 10, which is 16. Therefore, 1.2 power n more than 16 plus 1, which is 17. Now you can put log both sides. That is log 1.2 power n more than log 17. Bring a power in front and log 1.2 more than log 17. Therefore, n more than log 17 divided by log 1.2. n should be more than 15.53. n more than 15.53 means n can take the value of 16, 17, 18 and so on because n should be an integer. So what is the number they needed to complete the task? So we will get the smallest number for n. That is n equal to 16. So this gardener will take 16 days to dig an area of 800 meters square.